something? Not really. What's this? Oh, this looks like the treasury house. And it looks like there's nobody here. Alright. Hopefully they won't mind if I have a look around. Well, that's locked. All right, fine. I'll come back some other time. Excuse me. Just here to work. Ah, okay. I'll leave you to it then. Doesn't look like there's... Much useful. All right. Let's hear it. It's all fine. All right. That went nowhere. In that case, let's go see if we can find Nepos. Break the law and mark art. And it's off to sit in the mine with you. I'll keep that in mind. Got this. Nope. Beef in the ring. Care to try out a new ring? Or perhaps uh, make you a necklace? Where would he be? Oh, that sounds lovely. Let me just avoid this guard. Is he following me? I used to be an adventurer like you, and I took an arrow in the knee. <laughs> uh, was that a threat? Okay, I'm getting out of here. I don't think I've got anything worthwhile for elders to know yet. I wonder if it's one of those places. I suppose we can find out easily enough. I'm Gorza's assistant. Hello, Gorza. I need something? Nope. What now? You know, I'm surprised they're not commenting more on my face. Oh, the hag's cure. That said, I did clean it up to the best of my ability. Well, both of these are locked. And they both seem to be connected to the keep. So it's not... them. Oh, Nepos, where are you? I think I need another ale. That's the keep. And it looks like the silver blood isn't there anymore. All right. Interesting. Old city underneath the keep, the Shuenzel. Best to clear if you don't want a steam centurion carving you up. Right. I didn't sneeze, but that's all right. Elves. Well, I'm here. Hello, Eric. I'm Igman's uncle, as well as his steward. Yes, I'm looking for work. Anything you can share? The Jarl has put out a bounty on some bandits. Here, take a look at this decree for details. Bandits? I have letters to read. All right. Didn't know there were also bandits in the reach. <coughs> I suppose I should have expected it.
<sighs> that fight took a lot out of me, actually. Or maybe it's the ale. Who knows? Outsiders aren't trusted in Markov. Just keep that in mind. Oh, I'm learning. Yes, I am. This is a maze of a city. I don't know if he lives somewhere along here. Trouble? Not yet. Out of my way, outsider. <laughs> this looks like a an official place. Huh. I might be in the right place. Excuse me. What's your business here? I'm here to see Nepos. Is this his house? We haven't been expecting you and the old man needs his rest. Come back some other time. Wait. It's okay, my dear. Send her in. <laughs> yes, Nepos. You? Heard him? Go on in. All right. I'm going to keep my dagger at the ready. Actually, this looks like enough space to swing a halberd. Not without breaking something, but... I'm sorry about my housekeeper. She's a little protective of me. Now what is it you want? Now what is it you want? You sent a thug after me. I want to know why. Ah, yes. You've proven to be a real bloodhound. Well, you've sniffed me out. I've been playing this game for almost 20 years. Sending the young to their deaths. All in the name of the Force Woman. And I'm tired. So tired. You what? You're a monster. A monster? No. I'm just a servant. To my king, Madanok. When the uprising fell at the hands of the Nords, they threw him in the mines. I don't know how, but he lives. I get his messages, and I hand out his orders without question. Who is Madanok? He is the king in rags. A man who once held all the reach within his grip. He stokes the passions of the downtrodden in this city. Directs them to kill the enemies of the Forsworn in our name. All from inside Sidna Mine, a Nord prison. The irony is quite thick. An uprising? What kind of... What is this going on? Markarth and the Reach are our lands. That is why we are the Forsworn. We cannot claim the home that is rightly ours. But then, during their war with the Elves, we had our moment. We drove the Nords out of the Reach in a great uprising. Then Ulfric and his men came. Those of us who didn't run were executed, except for myself, my king, and a handful of others. You did quite a bit of execution of your own. Why are you telling me all this? My dear girl, what makes you think you're getting out of here alive? You were seen coming in. The girl at the door is a Forsworn agent masquerading as a maid. You aren't the first one to have gotten this far. You won't be the last. You are an evil old man, Nepos. I'm sorry. Damn, I come here. It would be my easy. pleasure to put you down. <sighs> Get back here, I'm not done with you. Do you now? You still have weapons drawn. I submit. Victory is yours. I submit. Time 
to finish this! They were cowering. And I called him a monster. What was that? I just... I just chased down and killed three people who were cowering. I work silver, like my father, and his father before him. Let me see if I can get some of the blood off my hands, at least. Oh, that's cold. <laughs> what is it? Still nobody here. What kind of honor is there in killing somebody who runs from you? Yes? Excuse me. Come, come, I haven't got all day. I'm a skull, aren't I? No skull would do that, but I just did. Disrespect the law, and you disrespect me. Huh. Come on in. The Silver Blood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. I need to sit down. There's no shipments Probably coming in, so in. I do nothing. Too lazy to give him a drink yourself. You want a drink? Yeah. Depends. Are you thirsty? Hungry? Both? Ale? Maybe? That would be good. I should remind Clever to clean this place up. Check the shipments, Elizabeth says. There are no shipments, I... Ah, some kind of holiday. You a fighting gal? How about a little bit? <laughs> uh Probably my dear loving. What kind of bet? I'm drunk, and it's been a while since I had a good fight. A hundred septum says I can take you. Barehanded. Just checking the guests. You know, on another day I might take you up on that. Not today. Milk drinker. <laughs> Do I look like a milk drinker to you? Here. Got any ale or mead? Have a mead on me. Ah, Ingvar. Yes, yes. Here to see. Find myself a drink. You know an in. Oh, 
Oi of the Silverblood family is always a guest of honor here. Shut it, Clem. My friend, a toast to a beautiful friend. Who cares? <laughs> oh, uh. such a model for decency in these troubled times. Right. Of My favorite drinking buddy. Let's get some meat. Nah, I think I'm done for the evening. I don't really care how early it is. Have I still got this room reserved or no? Um. Hmm. Evidently not. All right, that's confusing. Don't mind the dogs; they get anxious when they haven't had dinner. Hmm. This is the Silver Blood Inn. I'll let you figure out. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thanks. I'll let you get back to tending to I'll this. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Crowd, I guess not. Outsiders. <laughs> what? Bloody enough for you, outsider. What? Excuse me? What do you mean? Markarth, is it bloody enough for you? Are you threatening me? If I was threatening you, believe me, you'd know it. You outsiders never learn. If the Four Sworn don't get you, the guards will throw you in Sidna mine to work your fingers off. Think that's water in the river? Blood and silver are what flows through Markarth, friend. Yeah, Let me know yeah. if there's right. anything else. He's... Sorry, could you... Thanks. That... was a threat. <laughs> 